Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. We are rapidly getting closer to the delivery date of our soon to be baby girl that's growing in my belly. So I've been sorting through a lot of her baby clothes. It, it's been a bit different with this one compared to when we were waiting for Riley and Maggie because you might not be aware but with this one um, the last couple of scans I've had they've said that she's going to be quite a small baby and both Riley and Maggie were born around seven or eight pounds she's only weighing about 3.3 pounds at the moment so they've said that she's going to come up a bit small so for the first time I've had to actually get clothes for first size and not to one month instead of going straight to naught to three so that's been a bit different for me this time um, I'm not used to having really really small clothes I've washed all of her clothes from naught to one month and before I put them away I figured I'd just do a quick video and show you what we've actually got me and Nathan were a little concerned and worried about how we were going to be able to afford to get everything for a baby again because after we had Maggie, I was adamant that we weren't going to have any more kids. So we got rid of everything. We've had to start from scratch. We bought a few bits and pieces and we bought some clothes and everything for her. Babies grow in and out of clothes so fast within the first year that I was really concerned that would we be able to afford to buy new clothes every couple of months. Both Riley and Maggie have always been in the the age above what they're supposed to be in because they just had so many growth spurts. I don't know if Willow will be the same, but I want to be prepared just in case she is. I put out a few ads on Facebook. Over a couple of weeks, we actually had about four or five people come to us with bags of, of free clothes for Willow. And they weren't little bags, they were big bags. Now, because of the generosity of you guys on Facebook, we have all the clothes we need for her for 0 to 1, 0 to 3, 3 to 6, and most of 6 to 9. And we've got bits from 9 to 12 and 12 to 18, all the way up to three years, I think now. And obviously, when Maggie outgrows her stuff, we can pass it down to Willow anyway. To those people that have donated these clothes to us, we are so so grateful and we thank you so so much because it has saved us so much money and it has relieved my stress beyond compare <laughs> so yeah i just want to say thank you so so much to all of you that have donated these clothes i won't name you in case you don't want to be broadcasted or anything but honestly thank you so so much on to the actual clothes. This is all 0 to 1 month, which includes newborn, first size and 0 to 1 because I just wanted to bundle them all up together. So we'll start with the vests. So we have 15 vests. I like to have what I call two weeks worth and an extra because, you know, babies, they explode out of nappies, they make a mess. So it's nice to have a good few extras just in case. Okay, first one. Is this little cutie which says hello world this is from mini club tiny treasure this is newborn I'm not sure what brand mini club comes under but if you know put it down in the comments below that's the first one I haven't ironed any of them either so they're gonna be creased <laughs> next is an early days one in the newborn size with little flowers all over it very pretty we have an asda george one in newborn size this has got pink bows on it and little hearts. This one is from Matalan with some cute little hearts all over that one. This is a beautiful minty green coloured one. This is from F&F &F, which I think is Tesco. Could be wrong. We have another F&F &F one but this is the plain pink one. This is BB Bonito newborn. I don't know that brand name. That's pink with lots of little flowers on. Oh, they are roses, lots of little roses on. Next, we have another Asda George one. You are so loved. Nice little pink one again. We have a first size next one, which is this really pretty bunny rabbit one with polka dots. We have another Matalan one, which is like a completely sleeveless one with little flowers on. I don't know if you can see that the pattern has actually got hearts in it as well. This is early days. And this has got really cute little elephants on it. 
How cute is that? We have another one from Asda George, a stripy little number. Very colourful. Very pretty. We've got this one. This is one of my favourite ones. With all the little woodland animals on it in like um, a sketched effect, which is really nice. This is from Next. And then we have one from Mother Care in the Care Bears. And then we have a Disney um, Asda George one, but it's just got like um, blue flowers all over it. So I'm guessing this was part of a set, but I'm not sure what Disney thing it'd be from. Maybe Bambi or something. Next we'll go on to the sleep suits. This is one I found which I thought was really cute. It's actually like a pyjama set. This is Disney at Asda George. So it's got Piglet all over it. So it's got the trousers. And then it's got the top as well. How cute is that? So that'll be her first pair of pyjamas that she wears. So for our first actual sleep suit, we've got a pink flowery one from Asda George. We have another one from Asda George and lots of little pretty flowers, lots of different colours for this one. This is a personal favourite of mine just because of the woodland animals. I've got a thing for woodland animals at the minute. We've got all these nice blue and purpley pinky coloured ones. This is from Two, which I think is Sainsbury's, don't quote me on it. And this is one that came in with the pack with that one I imagine because it's got the same pattern at the top and it's also got one of the woodland creatures on the front there that's just a pink one this is from two but it's actually a gruffalo one so I think it's like the child of a gruffalo and a little one like that how cute we have one from peacocks which has got loads of little clouds on it we have some funky flower ones from Asda George again. We have another Asda George one, just plain pink. We have a pink cat one from two. Another Asda George one, white with little flowers on, and a couple of pockets on the front there. Another Asda George one, Asda George is doing very well for baby clothes. Um, a pink one with a little bunny rabbit on the front. Again, Asda George, lots of pink little bunny rabbits on that one. Another one from Asda George, this is blue flowers all over and a little label there that says lovely. And we have this beautiful grey one from F&F &F, which has got lots of little flowers on as well. I don't know why but I really like this one as well. And then finally, and then finally one of my other favourites is the tiny Tatty Teddy one. I was obsessed with Tatty Teddy. Um, when me and Nathan first got together and we used to collect, well, he used to buy me <laughs> loads of their ornaments and everything. I'm pretty sure both of the kids actually had a Tiny Tatty Teddy part of clothing as well. So again, we've got 15 sleep suits and the pyjama set as well, the piglet one. You always need spare. Wherever you go, you need spare. So it's just easier to have more and not need them than to need them and not have them. I suppose whilst we're on the sleeping thing i'll show you this the big sleeping bags that i've got oh yeah i'm showing everybody all the willow's baby clothes I like that one the so this is the first sleeping bag we've got it's disney as the george again um it's got the bunny on i don't know where this bunny's from which is really bad for me because i'm a huge disney fan but it's a lovely big sleeping bag very soft that would keep her nice and warm. This one is from Two, and this has got some nice little pretty flowers on, and then at the bottom, it's got some little Mises. I, I like to have a good collection of these as well, again, in case they make a mess in the night or anything. So we've got one more, again, <laughs> from Asta George. It's just a nice little pink, fluffy pink one, which says, sweet dreamer on it, in a heart. I've got lots of pink flowers on. Next, we've got dresses. Guess where this is from? What? Asda. <laughs> so got Asda George in this beautiful little dress, Aww. which has got little flowers on it, but it's also got like um, a jacket thing attached to it. Next, we have a really pretty, like stripy one with swans on the bottom. This is from Next. <laughs> so we've got two dresses, but then we've also got like um, these are body suits, I suppose you could call them. Oh. This is from F&F &F, and this has got cherry on that says yeah. sweet like you 
feet like you. So they're like little shorty ones. And then we've got another one which I think was from the same set in just plain red with like some flowers at the top there. Next I'm going to do tops. We have this Disney one of Bambi. Oh my god. How adorable is that? We have this one from F&F &F, which says Daddy's Little Heartbreaker. Of course we have one from Asda George that says Little Sweetie. We have one from M and Co that says Lovely. And another one from Asda George that says My Mummy Loves Me. This is one from Nutmeg that says Little Princess Sparkle Wherever You Go. We have another one from Asda George which is more of like a jumper really that says you make my heart happy. We have another Disney one. This has also got Bambi all over it. This is another one from Baby Bonito. I think they're rabbits on the front there in little tutus. And then I have this F&F &F one which has got a vest inside it. There's like a long sleeve top on top. So they are the tops. Trousers we have these cute little pink leggings from Asda George, more pink leggings from Two, we have some minty green leggings from Asda George again, Asda George again but we got some um, elephants and giraffes I think they are, yeah elephants and giraffes on these ones, we have some nutmeg uh, like maroony coloured leggings there, we have some F&F &F pink and white striped baby leggings we have some Pep and Co stripy ones in all fluorescent colours. We have some more BB Bonito leggings in the pink flowery ones. We have some Disney polka dot ones. I'm guessing this was part of like a Minnie Mouse collection. <laughs> we have these George like um, kind of jogging bottom ones, which are really cute. You've got butterflies all over them. And we have some white flowery ones from Nutmeg. And last one's again from Nutmeg, mint green with like woodland creatures down the side and some flowers. Last couple of things now, we have Asda George little pink cardigan and another Asda George cardigan, the buttons up at the front, but it's a red one. And then we've also got a little coat. Now we've got this coat from Asda George as well, which has got stars on it, but it's a reversible one. So you can turn it the other way. It's still got stars on it, but it's got smaller ones. It's got pockets on the inside and the outside. So you can have it whichever way you want, which I thought was really cool. And then of course, you have to have a snowsuit, no matter what age they are. Where's this from? <laughs> As to George. <laughs> so this is like a button up one in like a pink heart printed one. Very nice and padded and fluffy and soft for her. I've also got loads of socks, but I haven't paired them up or anything yet. I'll show you one pair. Some green little polka dot ones. And they're all this tiny. So there we go. That's all the clothes for her for the first month. I'm going to put them away now. And I'm going to sort out some of the stuff to go into my hospital bag as well. Because tomorrow I am officially 31 weeks pregnant. And with how things have been, I wouldn't be surprised if I end up going in early. So... At least everything will be where it's got to be and we'll be prepared. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!